Cesar and Lois are working with the fungal digital colonization of human knowledge systems through the merging of biological networks and internet-based communications. Degenerative cultures creates a bi-hybrid network in that living microorganisms and artificial intelligence work together. The resulting system makes visible the entropic patterns in human culture. We alone have the power of controlling the most violent of nature's offspring, the sea and the winds. We confine the rivers and straighten or divert their courses. In the end, by means of our hands, we endeavor to create, as it were, a second world within the world of nature. The book that is the substrate is literally eaten by fungi. The text is destroyed in a physical sense, and this destruction is visible through the redaction or disappearance of legible text on the surface of the pages. This data corruption is further analyzed by a computer vision program and communicated by algorithmically generated tweets and their automated readouts. The computer vision-based interface analyzes the living microorganism's growth and feeds a degenerative algorithm linked to cellular automata and sensitive analysis. This biodigital agent searches the internet for texts that follow similar predatory patterns. Just as the physical book is consumed by the growing culture, the digital database is corrupted by the degenerative algorithm. Readouts from the consumption of the physical book and the digital database are visible in the Twitter feed of at HelloFungus and printed out continuously on site on a thermal printer. In the bi-hybrid network, the bio-digital fungi respond to internet users' mentions, engaging others in the spreading of these digital spores. Alternate algorithms exist in the data passed along nature's conduits, including fungal spores and mycelia. Through experimentation and speculative growth cycles, by creating a conduit for fungal tweets, Cesar and Lois open up this question, how are we, humanity, technology, and nature, connected?